Have you ever heard about the Roman emperor who burned his own city? His name was Nero, and he is probably the most bloodthirsty emperor who ever lived. He didn't care about politics. He didn't care about his people. He just spent his nights in banquets and debauchery. For example, this guy kind of loved the theater, so he would go on stage and make the audience watch him for hours and applaud him. His excess of love for entertainment has emptied the coffers of the state, but anyone who opposed him was poisoned or executed. Indeed, the same day his mother criticized his conduct, he had her murdered. He also drives away his wife, Octavia, and has her assassinated to marry his mistress, Papia. However, soon after, she becomes pregnant and dies from a kick to the belly by Nero. Many sources claim that he ordered the Great Fire of Rome in 64 AD. After the fire, Nero rebuilds Rome and renames it Neropolis in a monumental style, with an immense palace for himself. To divert suspicions, he accuses the Christians and orders them to be crucified or burned alive. But the rebellious generals forced him to flee, shortly after he was found stabbed in the throat.